FIFA Under-17 World Cup qualifiers held in Ethiopia. The Mildren Cheche-led side will now shift focus to preparing for the second leg against Burundi, scheduled for Sunday, June 16, 2024, at the Ulinzi Sports Complex. And a win or a draw will secure them a place in the history books as the first Kenyan national team ever to reach the global stage. juu si kusikia wamepiga watu 24 hatukushtuka juni kawaida tukasema au wenye walipigwa si 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 sawa kuja wakutane na sisi wa Kenya tuonyeshe kweli sisi pia tunaweza the spirit iko very high tunajituma na tuna promise atwendi kuangusha country yetu tunaenda ku give our best so we worked a lot uh, tactically and also mentally to ensure that uh, uh, we do not judge them based on the previous results, but uh, what we can actually give at that particular time. So for us, we prepared ourselves well, uh, ready for the match, uh, not underestimating the opponent and also uh, not underestimating our ability to do well. Um, it's a big task. It's uh, one for the history. So the girls are prepared uh, to make sure we finish well. So we will encourage them. We will keep working for the five days we have and then hopefully we get a positive result that we will make uh, the country proud and our families proud. And so for me is to just tell Kenyans to trust the process. Trust the process. The process of identifying, nurture and monetize our talent is real. And if we do that, we can compete with anybody across the world. If we qualify, actually I should say, when we qualify for the World Cup, these girls would be going to the World Cup not just to add up numbers, not just to participate, but to compete against the very best in the world. Remember that the World Cup is a 16-team tournament consisting of the very best in the world. Africa would have only three teams, and if we qualify, we would be only one of three from this continent. So it's a big thing. It's a big deal. So my word is Hongera. Hongera to the girls.